Patrol Precinct, Sergeant Yamana. Yes, sir. A stolen car. Will you describe the car, please? Black fenders, silver doors, green hood, polka dot uh, seat covers, monkey fur dashboard. Maybe it wasn't stolen. Maybe it ran away. <laughs> Mr. Rivelli, uh, uh, will you hold it a minute? I, I gotta find a pencil. <laughs> okay, go ahead. <laughs> Call your insurance company. Yeah. Don't mention it. Oh my God, I ate my eraser. <laughs> Look at this. Huh. Well, a Japanese uh, thermometer factory just went out of business. Yeah, how come? Uh, they found traces of uh, swordfish in the mercury. <laughs> <laughs> They'd never bust up a great team like us. <laughs> What's that? Wait a second, some stuff came in. I'll check it. <laughs> reading with this flashlight. You know, they do look sort of funny. You shouldn't squint. <laughs> this isn't a squint. This is a squint. <laughs> oh, yeah. 12 Precinct, Yamana. Yes, ma'am. Screaming? What sort of screams? <laughs> well, ma'am, there are different sorts of screams. Were they screams of pleasure? <laughs> I mean, uh, did it sound like somebody needed help or was it just sort of an opinion? Uh, Yamana, could you give me a hand with sure. this, please? <laughs> Never mind, I know. Uh, Mr. Woolen, a man with your luck ought to go to Aqueduct today. There's a filly running in the fifth. Ought to go off at about uh, 20 to 1. You could pick yourself up about 70,000. No, 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 not me. I'd rather die than bet on a horse. <laughs> me too. But fortunately, I got true grit. Take it easy. Yamana, I wasn't making book. Uh, thanks, officer. I'll take over from here. I was just standing around. I swear. What are they busting me for? Convenience. Whose? Mine. I promise I'd lay off the phone. Hey, Nick, what's she doing? No, nothing. I walk in my sleep. Uh, what did you do to the coffee? Well, it was nothing special. It just takes a unique talent. I was afraid it was something like that. I can't take much more of this. <laughs> Mr. Woolen, my grandfather used to say to me, the anticipation of one's dreams is greater than the realization of one's ambitions. Unless one blows it all together. What? Think about it. You want a brownie? No, I want to go away from here. They're pretty good. Look, see, you dunk them, and they get nice and mushy. Thank you. Good word, mushy. A howling jackass, he calls me. I apologize to the jackasses. <laughs> I don't think this is funny. <laughs> funny. Funny boy. Funny boy. Funny boy. What's happening, baby? <laughs> Ha, <laughs> ha,
Like a bell that is ringing for me. And from the way when the bell starts to kick, you right? Barney, Barney, Barney. Is your mother from Kalani? Hey, uh, Barn, I think he's stoned. Stoned? What are you talking about? Hey, what do you say we guys go down to the beach and shoot some clams? <laughs> How many of these things have you had? Mushy, mushy. <laughs> I think that I think there's something in these things. The bell starts to feel. It's almost like being in love. <laughs> we better go down the back way. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Uh, Hogan said you needed some help up here. All right. Can you spell cat? Huh? Cat, damn it. Can you spell cat? We want guys with experience up here. <laughs> hey, Harris, do this. Yeah, okay. I heard it. It goes squish, squish. Beautiful, man. It's beautiful. <laughs> hey, what are you doing? What is... What is this? That's my lunch. <laughs> Smells like garbage. Garbage? Are you kidding? This is a Japanese delicacy. Fish heads, uh, cabbage leaves, uh, uh, cucumber rinds, uh, celery tops. It's terrific. <laughs> Come to think of it, that is garbage. 